Hello, uh, so today's topic is a uh, Decatron. It's a uh, kind of a counter vacuum tube. Indeed, it looks like uh, the vacuum tube, and indeed this is a vacuum tube, but uh, it does not have a function of amplification or detection or rectifying, nothing. The purpose is it's a counting. It's a counting device in 1950s, 60s. And it is not so fun like a uh, eight zero seven. It's a, a triode or no, it's a beam tube, but it's just a count. And uh, indeed, the socket is very special. It has a thirteen pin, and uh, I don't have uh, such a special socket. And uh, indeed, I can have, I can get at eBay, but a bit expensive, uh, including the shipping cost to Japan. So I made uh, several uh, 3D printing uh, prototype. This is the first one. Uh, the pin was so tight and I cannot in inside include the electrode and this is second. And uh, I, can I can insert the electrode. However, the the height is too too high so i made several uh, prototype and finally i made this type of device showing just a spinning top a spinning uh, light on the decatron indeed uh, the circuit is very simple you see, it's consisting of a capacitor and resistor. That's all. Uh, here is a hues. And uh, the, from the AC100, uh, inside it's a double voltage rectifier producing the around uh, 400 volt. And that is applied to this decatron. And also, the AC100 volt has a fan, uh, frequency of 50 hertz in the uh, eastern part of Japan and that will produce a clock to spin and uh, indeed the function the operation is looks like a rotary encoder two or uh, two phase two clock is required for moving forward uh, clockwise or counterclockwise so i just uh, uh, it, this is not my uh, only circuit not not my invention but mostly utilized by, uh, by using the uh, res uh, resistor and the capacitor and we can make some small phase shift for one to the other and this is clock uh, generating the two phase clock for driving this decatron now let's see how it works indeed 400 volt is a bit high so I made the enclosure for the safety, for my safety. And uh, I will apply 100 volt. And uh, maybe I will switch off the light to show. And uh, I will switch now on. You see, now is the spinning is uh, clockwise. And I put the switch. Now it's counterclockwise. Yeah, that's all. Uh, not so fun, maybe, uh, because in the case of amplifier, we can enjoy the sound, but this is just uh, rotating the light inside the tube. And of course, this is counting device, so originally this is utilized in the computer to show the data or store the data. But uh, um, at this moment, I just make this type of device a fan.